Hello friends, welcome to another video. In today's video, we are going to talk about how we can download the free indicators for our MT5 platform. And uh, I'm not talking about those indicators like uh, MACD, RSI, or moving averages. I'm talking about the kind of indicators like as you can see on my screen. So as you can see, there is a, a candle timer running on the upper right uh, uh, upper right corner. There is a, a pip counter, as you can see here, and there is another candle timer running on the lower right corner. So basically, but this pip counter is going to show you the uh, pips of a current running trade, whether it's in uh, uh, positive or negative, depending upon if you are in profit or loss. And as you can see, this uh, another candle timer. This is going to show you the uh, uh, time remaining for a candle to close in hours, minutes, and seconds. The another indicator onto the downside is going to show you the spread of the instrument that you are trading. Plus, it is also going to show you the uh, candle time remaining to close in minutes and seconds. Now, the difference between the two is this one is going to show you the time in hours, minutes, and seconds, and this candle timer is going to show you the time in minutes and seconds. So, as we if we click on the four hour uh, chart then you can see that this is going to this candle timer is going to show you two hours 16 minutes 25 minutes to like remaining for this candle to close and uh, the another indicator onto the downside is showing you 136 minutes remaining for this uh, four hour candle to close so uh, so this is guys so if you want to know how you can download these kind of indicators for your mt5 then uh, this is the video for you so what do we have to do? We have to open our MT5 and we have to go to the navigator section. Uh, once you click on the navigator section, then you have to come to the market section. On the market, there is an indicator section. Click on the indicator and you will come to this window. Now in this window, you can, uh, this is basically a library where you can find out all the indicators paid or free. You can, uh, we can also see different sections. New indicator is going to show you new indicators whether paid or free. Uh, you, we can come to the free section as well. What we we also have an option to search here. So first of all, we will start with the pip counter. We will search pip counter. So this is going to show you all the pip counter, free and paid. So we have few. So as you can see, the one which is on the number one blue digit uh, FX. So this is the one which I have already uh, downloaded. So it is showing the open button for me. But if you are doing it first time, this will show you with the download button, right? So click on the download button and uh, uh, after downloading, it will come in the indicator section. On the indicator section, you can see that we have the inbuilt indicators and then there is a market section as well. So you click on the market section, this will show you the indicator that you downloaded for the from the market section below. So this is going to be the pip counter. Uh, other functionality of this, uh, I'm gonna tell you later in the video. Then we go and check the next uh, uh, indicator, which is the candle timer. You click on the candle timer we have a lot of uh, go to the free section so this will filter out the free candle timer for you now we have as you can see we have a lot of indicators here so what you can do you can just download these one by one and check which one is going to be good for you more or less these are the same there is not much difference but uh, uh, the one uh, that you can see on the first number is uh, going to be the one which uh, which i already downloaded and which you can see here on the right upper corner. So this is going to be the one. You click on that, it is showing open because I have already downloaded it. Depending upon that, you can try other ones as well. So what we will do, let's uh, try uh, downloading uh, one. So this is already downloaded. I will just, this is already downloaded. Uh, this is already downloaded. So let's delete few so that we can have uh, something available and I can show you how we can download I think uh, this one nothing is work yeah nothing is showing right now okay but this one is showing so what we're gonna do we will just click on the download button so it's going to work like that you click on the download button and uh, you will see that uh, this candle is available right now under this indicator section so what do you have to do once you download your indicator what do you have to do you have to go to your chart section come to the charts and drag the indicator that you have just downloaded onto your charts once you click that you will have this window pop up so what you can do you can change the functionality in this particular uh, indicator we don't have much things available but i'll show you another indicator that how you can change the things so what you have to do you have to drag the indicator on the chart and click okay so that will be available so as you can see the indicator that we have just downloaded 
is a candle timer which is just showing you the times remaining for this candle to close and uh, it's not having many options to just uh, change the location so it is just showing you with the uh, color and uh, with the same color font and the pretty next to the candle so after downloading the indicator and putting them onto the chart so uh, what you can do you can change their features you can change their location font size color so how you're going to do that so as you can see on my charts we have one two three four so i have four indicators one pip counter and three candle timers so what you're going to do you click uh, right on your chart go to the indicator list and you will find all the indicators which are currently shown on your chart right so what we're going to do suppose we want to change something for this indicator which is in the right upper corner so this is going to be the first indicator click on that go to the properties and uh, this window is going to pop up so what we have the options like you can change the font size i'm going to change the font size to uh, just uh, double click on that change the font size to 10 suppose we can also change the location so right now it's the right upper corner so double click and you will have the these options to uh, let's put it left lower chart corner right go to the color section let's change the color to yellow suppose okay so we have done the changes say okay so as we can see that uh, indicator is now available on the left lower corner so the same way if you want to download i mean you want to delete the indicator you can down delete it from uh, your um, i mean chart and if you want to change the any features on your available uh, indicator you can change that as well so this was the video i hope you enjoyed the video and if you really did like the video share the video and subscribe to the channel in order to support the channel and youtube algorithm thank you very much see you in another video